Mini PCs have come a long way, and the Tricky G5 is proof of that. It's compact, powerful, and packed with high-speed connectivity that could make it the ultimate budget-friendly workstation or even a soft router. But is it really worth it? Let's find out! Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're taking a deep dive into the Tricky G5 Mini PC, unboxing it and seeing how it stacks up against the competition. Let's jump right in! Right out of the box, you get the Tricky G5 itself, a power adapter, an HDMI cable, a VESA mount, and a quick start guide. Let's talk design. The Tricky G5 is compact, minimalist, and well-built. It has a matte blue finish that feels premium, and despite its size, it has plenty of ports to keep you connected. The Tricky G5 Mini PC measures 11 by 12.5 by 4 centimeters and weighs just 382 grams, making it incredibly compact, lightweight, and portable enough to fit almost anywhere. Now, let's take a look at the ports and connectivity options that make this Mini PC even more versatile. On the front, you get two USB 3.2 ports, a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and the power button. Around the back, you'll find dual HDMI 2.0 for multi-monitor setups, two 2.5G Ethernet ports, another USB port, a Type-C USB port, and of course, the power input. Now, let's talk about what's inside. The Tricky G5 is powered by the Intel N100 processor, a 4-core, four 4-thread four CPU with a boost clock of up to 3.4 GHz. It comes with 16 GB of DDR5 RAM and a 500 GB PCIe SSD, Wi-Fi 6, Bluetooth 5.2, and Windows 11 Pro pre-installed. With the internals covered, let's see how the Tricky G5 performs in real-world benchmarks from Geekbench.com. So, should you buy the Tricky G5 Mini PC? Well, if you need a compact, energy-efficient, and high-speed mini PC for office work, media consumption, or even a home server, it's a great choice. That's it for today's review. What do you think about the Tricky G5? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tech reviews. See you in the next one!